Hey, that's Mike and Holly, Alex, Eddie, and Chelsea. Hey guys, it's the day after Halloween. I am going to de-Halloween everything, put all the Halloween stuff away. I already told Alex this morning that we need to work on it and she needs to help me because um, it's supposed to rain outside. Well, of course, it's supposed to rain tomorrow and we have all of our outdoor stuff out front. So I was like, I want to bring all that in before it rains. Plus, you know, it's the day after Halloween. So I just kind of feel like packing it all up and bringing out whatever little Thanksgiving things we have. Like we'll still leave. Our fall leaves are still going to stay up. Um, on the banister and on the table and over in the corner my flowers are gonna stay and I think we only have like a couple of like little um, Thanksgiving type decorations to take out so maybe we need to work on getting some more fall type stuff but anyway we're gonna go and we're gonna de-Halloween the house inside and out it's our specialty zombie massage <laughs> Get it today, last day of the special. <laughs> Are you getting scratchings? Oh, did you like that? Do you feel good? Here, let me try it on you. On me. Tell me if it feels good. Turn around. Ooh, it feels weird. Oh, it actually does feel kind of good. Other, other one, there you go. <laughs> I need both of them going at the same time. Tickle, weird. tickle, tickle. <laughs> Yeah, I figured there was a screen. Okay, you guys, we have a huge wasp nest that's up at like the peak of our roof where it's really high so you can't reach it from the ground. I've watched this thing grow and grow and now it's like huge. So, oh, it's in the worst spot. It is, it's like almost impossible to get to. We have to open the window, take the screen out and the wind's blowing too. You don't want that stuff to blow into your face. Yeah, <sighs> Essentially straight up too. Oh no, I just don't want you getting it in your eyes. Oh yeah, of course Ed's got to be in the way. Come on, the wind's like blowing everything, and then you got to be able to. Oh, I didn't think this was gonna work. And then you're gonna have to close the window too. Oh yeah, man. Is it spraying down on you? Yeah. I was gonna see if I could get it on camera, but I can't see anything. Can you guys see it? There. <laughs> Busted up out the hockey mask. Oh my gosh. Well, yeah, Goalie that, mask. I mean, it'll shield more, but I still got holes where. You probably should have done. Can you do both? Your goggles <laughs> and. Like, you want to be protected. Uh, I don't think. The only thing I worry about is the wind. It might not do much good if. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, it already, I, it protected my eyes, but it all blew in my hair. Oh, Ed, come and on. I don't even know if I've got it. And you might even have to close the window real quick so they don't oh, fly in the house. Yeah. Plus, the sun's like right there, so it's like right in your eyes. And this is just a little too high. Get her step stool. Nope. Oh, I can see it raining down. Oh my gosh. It did the wind blow it? Take a sh well, yeah. I'm shooting it at an angle. So yeah. normally, if gravity would pull it down. Right. <laughs> I don't know, man. It is still pretty far up there. Oh, uh, that's pretty long. Uh, I closed the window because they were kind of flying around. And I didn't want them flying into the house. Did you get it? Yep. Quick, close the window. <laughs> oh no. All right, so the pole knocking it down worked. It's now on the side of the house. So Michael, he's ready for winter. Oh my gosh, don't stroke out from the heat. He's gonna go finish him off with the spray now. Okay, so Michael went out and sprayed the nest, but he said all the wasps are like hovering up near the roof where their nest was. Uh, so. I think you made their hornets. Oh, 
Really? Big, they look like wasps to me. Our wasps are big. Oh. So anyway, hopefully he's like, we're, we're thinking they're probably just going to rebuild, but because that's what they do. They started on our front porch. They started in the roof section up there. Remember I had to climb out on the yeah, roof Yeah, that's right, during the hurricane when you were putting the shutters. Yeah. So before, they were on our front porch, and then they were um, in this, like, window that's hard to get to. You have to go out onto the roof in order to get to it. They had built a nest up there, like, outside, of course, but in that window. And so Michael had to hit him with a hockey stick and then jump in, you know, like hurry up and get back in the house and stuff. That was when we were putting the hurricane shutters on a year ago during Hurricane Irma. But this nest on the side of the house was massive and it was just really hard to get to. So they'll, what'll happen is they'll rebuild. They'll just build it somewhere else maybe, or we'll just have to keep watching for them and knock them down again. <laughs> She's a unicorn. So <laughs> it's like flopping behind you or on your ponytail. It's so funny. Trick or treating last night, we got halfway around the neighborhood and she's like, I'm done with this thing. And she took it off. There were actually a couple of kids that had the same costume as her. It was kind of funny. And then tonight, we're going outside just to play for a little bit before it gets too dark. So she's got to wear her accessories. I love that though, the ponytail. Double ponytail, colorful, rainbow colored.